Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpisami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation on the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpisami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Greetings everybody guys, today we will take a look at the Japanese Yen, so the current situation uh, needs some update because we have the long term trade here that's based on the weekly bearish grammar, so here you see on the weekly chart uh, this setup, so that's the grammar itself and we said that market should take in out of these lows, at least it should take in out of these lows. In perspective, we could get even deeper action approximately 104.50 area. It's 1618 extension of this inner ABC uh, D pattern stands. Also, guys, this target coincides with the larger ABC top minor 618 extension. So, the, this extension stands approximately the same area. It's very close to it. So, here this will be logical destination in an even longer perspective. But uh, our setup is based just on the taking out of these lows. It's approximately 1 or 780 area. The market gradually is moving down. Speaking guys on our yesterday Canadian dollar setup, so you could see that it has worked. Uh, market uh, actually has shown this retracement up precisely to our confidence. Retest this line. Some kind of the wedge pattern has been formed here. So the setup that we have discussed uh, has worked very nice. So uh, on the Japanese yen, guys, you know the recent events around the Doha and the Casual. Uh, so this is Middle East turmoil started. And that's of course uh, supportive to, to Japanese yen because this currency is treated usually as the safe haven uh, and this gold market and the Japanese yen usually uh, feels the backwind when some turmoil uh, in the political sphere uh, happens. So what we have right now on the daily chart guys you can see that the trade actually has started very nice so if you remember inside of this flag we have traded the uh, when by the sell pattern in the forward income chart we started market has dropped right now as you can see the market is not at uh oversold and actually it has no real real support in this swing because all major supports have been broke next support area will be already around now a target so around one or seven eight area it's already has been tested once as market has completed this ABCD target so uh, it means that the next destination will be final point of the stop grammar trading, but maybe not the, the totally final in overall trading to the downside. Because as I said, this could be approximately 104, 104, 50 or it's 1618 extension. Uh, that's also, as you can see, uh, this ABCD pattern actually. So market has completed ABCD, 618 retracement, and continue down. And on the way down, we see this stronger downward acceleration. This is a really good sign uh, for this ABCD pattern that suggests that maybe market indeed will continue move here. So what we could do right now, this uh, today guys we will discuss some chances that exist as for uh, separate trading, as isolated trading for the scalp traders, as for daily traders who uh, has missed the entry opportunity here and thinking about going short. And we'll take a look at the follow attempt from chart here we have the perfect butterflies forming uh, market right now stands at the monthly pivot support one and you can see it slightly hasn't completed the target of the butterfly. Also right at the same point we have the inner to butterfly A, B, C top D patient. It's one six one extension, extension of this A, B, C, D patient also um, coincides with the butterfly extension. Taking into consideration the speed of this drop is really fast, we could count only on minor bounce. Uh, so if you would like to trade this butterfly on the long side of the market, do not marry in position, take the fast profit and close position because such, such accelerations here and here gives a hint, gives us a hint that, that uh, the downward action will continue. So that's what be the just temporal or the temporal bounce in the target and minor retracement. The most logical target of this possible trade is 110.20 area. This is a 3.8 resistance of the butterfly action. 
that's also previous lows guys so market could just retest these lows this upward bounce and then continue move down so uh, for those of you who would like to take short position that's the chance to think about taking short around 11021 because this will be minor retracement this market actually has no supports from that point till the final destination market is not ever sold that's why retracement here as i said probably should not be too significant so what you could do so if you intend to trade butterfly on the long side just trade or retracement to this butterfly you need to drop your time frame to the hourly chart and watch for bullish reversal patterns here currently nothing has been formed yet because market just has reached this destination point but taking in consideration the targets that slightly lower is one or nine approximately it means that here most probable this will be either butterfly the 109 action or let it turn, take the shape of the hand shoulders something of that sort could be formed here uh, this market could start the upward bounce so as soon as we will get this patch we could try to trade it long -term. for others uh, who would like to take the short position you need to watch for the final point of this retracement i suppose that should be around 120 area then maybe this we will get the chance to take the short and downward continuation that's the situation that we see right now on the Japanese yen. as you can see patterns rather clear so it should be interesting to deal with them